Hey guys, what's up Taurus? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. It's going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with. So flip it how you need to. Also remember, it's a general reading. So take what's yours and leave the rest behind. Alright, if this does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, find that below as well. Alright, media future for Taurus. What's coming up? Hey, alright. Not well. I don't know how that's going. Let's just see. Looks like there was someone detaching from something. Like emotionally. Leo energy. Nine of cups. One more for Taurus. Alright. Well. Whatever you're doing. You're coming out successful. Because you're ending with the six of wands. And you have the nine of cups. So something here is. Clearly making you happy. You could be seen in the public eye. Show me the strength card. Numbers breaking down to an eight. Eights are about change, movement, and as I said, that the tower. But too many. Thank you. All right, the wheel. So definitely about change, um, divine timing. Things are moving forward, possibly pretty fucking quickly here. With the Knight of Wands, you could be dealing with an Aries Leo Sag. There could be an age difference. Hmm. It's almost like somebody's blocking their feelings here. Oh, no. They want to stand for it. They want to work for it. This person, somebody has... This could be around somebody that you work with. Um, money's looking good. But... With the Queen of Queen of Wands here, again, Aries Leo Sag energy, you could have multiple offers, but there's one person that's like it one they really strongly want to come towards you. So things are changing because with the Page of Cups here, somebody has uh at the very least romantic feelings. So they're trying to like put in the work. You may be really busy with work lately. Tell me about that Queen of Wands. Because something you're doing here is making you very noticed, like on a pedestal type thing. Definitely seen, noticed. Show me that nine of cups. You're feeling good as hell about something. It could be around work and things are moving quickly, but there's some type of change here that's destined for you. It could be with somebody who's younger or, you know, things like that. But, um... Something here. It looks like something, someone that's possibly at a distance. It's like they want, they, they have, they have feelings. They want to work on things with you. Show me. All right. All right. Give me, uh, show me that nine of cups for Taurus. Because this is your wish fulfillment. The six of swords. Could be moving or traveling. Show me that six of swords. Wow. Oh, wow. Somebody may pop up for some of you. They could be traveling. But the moon is here. So there's something here that's going to kind of happen out of the blue. Um, and you don't see it right now. Show me that moon. What's hidden? That's Cancer Pisces energy. The lovers. Gemini energy. Someone that you're extremely passionate about. Something could have came in. If this is a past person. Like something could have came in between y'all. But there's nothing negative here. Show me that lovers. The emperor and the two of swords. Aries energy. You don't see this right now. There's something here that kind of pops up. And it looks like it makes you incredibly happy. Show me that six of wands. The Six of Wands, like I said, incredibly happy. That's success. You definitely could be seen um, in the public eye. There could be an apology coming for some of you guys. But you have the King of Cups, the Ten of Cups. There's your Empress. That's you. 
you're going towards some type of new opportunity here um and with the king of cups even if you're not dealing with the cancer scorpio pisces you have the ten of cups so this could even be a friendship that turns into more um but somebody here uh we do have the five of cups so you know it could be a situation a person that let you down in the past and maybe that's why you don't see this coming because it's just gonna pop up and shock you um but it does make you incredibly happy and put you in like an emotional heart space because you have a divine counterpart here with the emperor and the empress you definitely have some it feels like really cool things coming like especially if you've been busy with work even if you're not somebody is really noticing you here so it's like something just kind of comes up pops up out of the blue could be traveling or moving but whatever this is for you because you know it'd be different for everybody it makes you incredibly happy shit drop the card and you're coming in as the empress beautiful wifey like matching this person's uh energy is how it looks like so with the king of cups um this person may have kind of been shy with their emotions in the past the king of cups is not always even though he's the king of emotions wear him on his sleeve um this could be somebody it doesn't have to be who who works in healthcare or something like that uh as well this could be a, a friendship you know like a best friend thing kind of turn it into more but it looks like this definitely makes you happy and I, you've been manifesting it queen of cups the ace of cups a lot of love coming here for you all right taurus i hope this helps i hope it resonated yeah this person has a lot of feelings for you and they're they're bringing it straight to you all right taurus i hope this helps i hope it resonated if so please make sure that you like and subscribe below if you guys would like to contact me for a personal reading find that below as well you guys take care and i'll see you next time bye